Hello and hi everybody, welcome back to another one of this time. I'm here with another one from the king of YouTube himself. You guessed it, Mr. Beast. And this one is, I spent seven days in solitary confinement. Yeah, Jimmy's gonna go insane. He's more likely gonna go crazy. He's gonna go, he's gonna do random ass shit that he would normally not do. But since he's trapped in there, he's gonna be doing a lot of random shit. He's gonna go lose his mind, so... Yeah, let's just see if he does survive the seven days. So, with that being said, if you have not yet subscribed to the King of YouTube himself, something is seriously wrong with you. Be sure to go subscribe. The link to the original is in the description. So, with that being said, let's get into this. I'm going to attempt to spend the next seven days in solitary confinement. Oh, Seal me up. Bye, Jimmy. Okay, there you go. Done, I won't For be surprised. For the next seven days, I have to survive in this soundproof white room with zero human contact and zero stimulation. Oh, and because okay. this is actually psychological, Psychologically dangerous. The most important thing is the doctor outside making sure I don't go insane. I worked in psych hospitals for 23 years, and uh, this is much worse than anything I've ever seen. Okay. Anything past 50 hours in a white room like this can lead to permanent psychological damage. And I'm about to do 168 hours. There is a Didn't chance that I actually I start to lose my mind and go into something called psychosis. <laughs> They have to pull me out because it could cause permanent damage to me. Oh he survived God. seven days buried alive. Yeah. Is this much harder? Much harder. He doesn't have social contact. If your brain doesn't have information coming in, it generates craziness, it generates hallucinations, oh. it generates paranoia. And all I have to survive for the next week is a bed to sleep on, a notebook with a pen, a refillable bottle of water, a toothbrush with toothpaste, and a bar of soap, a toilet to use the bathroom, and a sink for water. At this point, it was clear to me it was going to be difficult to entertain myself during this challenge, especially on hour nine when I did this. You're probably wondering how many tiles are on these walls. The correct answer is 1900. And if you want the roof and floor included, then it's 2860. Is that but more true? importantly than all of that, according to my stomach, it is time to eat food. If you're wondering how I'm eating during this challenge, there's a conveyor belt here, which spans over 100 feet. So I can what? be fed without any human interaction. I think I've been in here around Damn. 14 hours. Isn't it crazy that at this point, I was already off by two hours. Jesus. So far, the hardest part of the challenge is no one's fed me yet. In hindsight, I should have ate more food before I came in here. What? But yeah, it would be really nice if someone fed me sometime soon. Your boy is very hungry. Oh. <laughs> did you wash your hands? Pancakes? No, he did not. We'll be sending him his meals randomly so he can't guess the time. Like it's 6 p.m. right now and we're sending him his breakfast. <laughs> When are my friends gonna feed me? I am hungry, I am hungry. Now because the room is soundproof, even though the food arrived, I didn't realize it until I checked two hours late. Too hungry. Oh my god. That's a little dramatic, man. Come on. So when I finally checked, oh, I was uh, not actually expecting food. <laughs> this tastes awesome. I mean, it's cold and soggy. Uh, I'm just so deprived of feeling things. This is, this is great. This solitary confinement once. set is literally wrapped in metal chains. If this set caught on fire, I would probably burn alive before they could unlock it. Uh, Coming in. Mm -hmm. All new Pizza Hut. Dude, yeah, this is already so you. bad. Like, me personally, I don't know if I can ever survive in there. Anyways, I'm gonna think about other things than that. <laughs> For the next few hours, I tried to keep myself as stimulated as humanly possible. Oh. oh. That's kind of cool. He's got nothing. He has nothing to work with. If he's already resulting to this for basic stimulation, I have my doubts that he'll last seven days. It's interesting how when you take everything away from a man, something as simple as a metal plate can be like as fun as an iPhone. Yeah. He's going to get agitated by way of boredom. This is a very dehumanizing experience. I'm just going to go to bed and we'll see what happens. Is it going to be hard for him to sleep? I think I'm around 40 hours into the challenge. Jimmy's oh. six hours off on what time he thinks it is. Which means it's around 4 p.m. on day number two. I thought he'd be on track today. Losing my sense of time led to other problems. No matter what I do, I literally just can't sleep. You can't sleep These lights are just really messing with my brain. Maybe I just lay here for the next five days. The reason he has insomnia is he doesn't need to sleep. He wants to sleep this off just get it over with uh, but what insomnia. you should be doing i i kind of have a some insomnia fuck i can't speak because i would wake up in the middle of the night i don't know if that's really insomnia i think insomnia is just you can't sleep at all but like normally like almost every night i would wake up in the middle of the night like it could be random times it could be 12 2 3 4 a.m like it's fucking crazy but normally i just have to piss and then go back to sleep and then i'll just fully back to sleep 
Like, normally this is, like, a problem for me for, like, a few years, where I would just wake up randomly in the middle of the night. Sometimes twice, sometimes three times, sometimes even four times. It's like, I feel like I have a problem or some shit like that. <sighs> Probably because I'm always on my phone before I go to sleep. He's trying to do something that is going to occupy his attention while he's awake. He's climbing the wall. It's the natural human urge for freedom. He's regressing to primal instinct. Why did I think it was 4 p.m.? Shouldn't that mean it's 9 p.m.? And by the time I had gotten around to eating my first meal, it was 4.30 in the afternoon. Don't get me wrong, the food looks good, but it is freezing cold. <laughs> I'd rather starve than eat the rest of this. So... Aww. And when my second meal had arrived, it felt like only minutes had passed. What just came through the conveyor belt? Wait, how long has it been? Am I supposed to eat both, or...? Uh it definitely was day two when I got the second breakfast but i didn't eat much of the breakfast so maybe they felt bad because i didn't eat much of the breakfast well no at this point i had no idea how long that first meal was sitting in the conveyor belt for he sees he's getting a little paranoid that's the thing that can get worse as Jesus time goes on. he's already really experiencing care. paranoia i'm not sure what to do i think i'm gonna just see how high i can count one two three four it looks five, crazy five, right five six five five six six five six seven but when you're in a situation where there's nothing to do 999 what's crazy is to just succumb to it 1000 as this progresses he's gonna run out of random things to do and i gotta give it to him the doctor was right because later in this challenge i borderline go insane oh my god do you think i'd get it do you think i'd get it? holy shit i have a feeling he's gonna get out of this challenge early because it's crazy god damn how much food is it oh Well, does Mr. B see it? Oh, he's asleep. He can't see and it. And while my strategy to sleep through most of the challenge did help pass the time, it ended up hurting me in other ways. Uh, I see food over there. It's freaking soggy and cold. How long has this been sitting here? This food's been sitting there for seven hours. Seven hours? I would have given anything to eat that ice cream. Uh, it would have been nice to have edible parts of the meal. Well, I guess I'll just be hungry again. Normally, because we're working on so many videos at once, I'm usually, like, incredibly stressed. As of right now, I don't really feel that stressed at all. But I feel a ton of anxiety because I have this severe FOMO that I'm missing tons of cool stuff going on in the world. Yeah, it's weird. that's kind of It's mean. a different emotion that I'm used to. It's pretty crazy how hard it is to do nothing. Yeah. I'm starting to get really bored. Oh, this is getting very hard on me mentally. I'm bored. Help. I was nowhere near the 168 hour mark. So no by hour 65, near. Not even... I started to wonder. How do you do a handstand? <clears throat> before I came in here, I had someone teach me the basics of how to do a handstand. He's gonna have to invent concepts that only exist in his mind to keep himself from experiencing intense depression. I'm just gonna envision that I'm currently walking in a park. There's green grass. Someone's fishing. He's literally making up scenarios in his head right now. <laughs> all in all, it's very sunny. I hear birds. And Ruined by walk in the park. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh We're bad. watching him slip into madness. Oh, can you see the food? Mm -hmm. They gave me more food. But it looks like we got some rice, sweet potato, and steak. This is the best meal I've gotten so far at this channel. It's actually if you look warm. right here, you'll see some rice. And any ordinary human would probably eat this rice. But I'm going to count it. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, 101, 102, 103, 104, 105, 106, 107, 108, 109, 110, 111, 112, 113, 114, 115, 116, 117, 118, 119, 120, 121, 122, 123, 124, 125, 126, I no. wasn't even halfway through the challenge. It was already off a full day. Almost a I'm full day. I'm gonna get some more day. disease in the bathroom where it's not so freaking bright. Which proved to be my smartest move yet because I actually slept in that bathroom for 12 hours. What? We're officially halfway into the challenge. 84 hours. Jimmy is. I'm gonna tell him that in his next meal. Just to kinda mix it all up for him. I mean, you can still put the letters together. Well, I, I guess he'll never find out. Yeah, I am. What are we working with here? 
What is this? Bro's never heard of SpaghettiOs? And that wasn't the only thing I was forgetting the name of. What is this called? Bread. This is a... He forgot things. A roll. This is a lot of sauce for one roll. It kind of tastes like ketchup. How does he not notice the letters in there? Oh, that's an N. Yeah! You guys forgot to take these four SpaghettiOs out. No. Every time he finds a letter, he just keeps eating it. I hope those weren't supposed to spell something. I was magically supposed to realize that before I ate them and then put it together to figure out a word for more food. Well, surely that's not what they wanted from me. Jimmy's about to watch this when he gets out and feels so dumb. <laughs> Depression. At this point, the bright lights were starting to get to me. I have a ginormous headache right now, and I'm so hungry. What is going on to my body? My well, he did ask for more food, even though he is getting all the calories he needs. But the reason for that is that he's so understimulated, he thinks he's starving. I ended up checking for food over and over and over He again. needs more food. This is oddly soothing. Do you think I'd get a concussion from doing this? You should probably stop. You're right. I should probably stop. I can't even imagine There's a bag how of McDonald's just here. There. It's suspiciously light. If there is not McDonald's in this bag, I'm going to be depressed. There actually is. Fries. Let's go. Oh. Every time I get a meal, it's like 20 minutes of just pure happiness. Yeah. I feel human again. I can't stop smiling. <laughs> I'm so happy. And then the second I finish it, I feel a wave of depression because I'm like, what do I do now? Damn. The seconds are starting to blend together so much. I would try to guess what time it is, but I have no earthly idea. My mind is slowly deforming into stupidity. I need to occupy myself better. We're going to grab this McDonald's cheeseburger wrapper, as well as this cup that was holding my toothbrush. And now we have basketball. LeBron, Steph, Kobe. Yeah. Maybe basketball is not my thing. I was always better at baseball. That was not what was supposed to happen. And then oh, I remember. Broke the train. I, oh, there's a fork on it. And I had an indestructible plate from my very first meal. I am going to throw this so far. It is hilarious. Oh, wow. I'm bored. I still have two days left inside this room, and I have a feeling at some point I'm gonna want to leave. It's day four. No matter how much I beg or scream or plead <laughs> or burp, do not let me out of this room. Three room. more okay, days, I got you. My instincts tell me I've so far done 113 hours, which means I have 55 hours remaining. And no. whoever's editing this, show them how many hours I actually have remaining. Hopefully, it's somewhere close to 55 hours. No. I think he's going to get angry and possibly paranoid about what's going on. Is a man not allowed to have privacy? There's a camera there. There's a camera above that. There's a camera, 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 camera. camera everywhere. Camera. Every there's so camera. many cameras on me 24-7. I'm going to go insane! What if we throw the camera through the commit? Genius. I treat it like bowling. Oh, well, he knocked my, over another my one. My finger. Ow. Ah! Holy fuck. I severely underestimated how hard this video would be. Just thinking about it has me, like, tearing up. But I kind of feel like an animal right now. Like, I feel like I lost it's all my rights like as one. a human. If I had to guess, I would say I'm halfway through day five. I really miss my girlfriend. And I miss the gang as well. Even Nolan. <laughs> <laughs> Nolan? Even Nolan. Mentally right now, I'd say I'm at that. like literal rock bottom. And like this is very inhumane. I've been in here so long that some of my dreams are about me in this room. And I think it's like day six or seven, but then I wake up and realize it was a dream. What time is it? I would pay so much money to know what freaking time it is. Let's go over why I think there are 33 hours left in this challenge. No. Um, I've guessing. slept five times. Ah! Reason number two, I usually poop once a day, and I've also pooped five times since I got here. Reason number three, I've grown a lot of hair on my neck here, and this usually does take like a week. If for some reason it's still... <laughs> if for some reason it's still day five, or God forbid it's somehow still day four, I will lose my mind. While I was sleeping, I had a dream about the one time that I counted to 100,000. And so when I woke up, I decided to do a thousand laps around this room. Wow. You know, for old time's sake. That'll be the marker. 
One. Watching two, back this footage, three. it's literally crazy. I resorted to walking in circles to keep myself safe. Jesus. A thousand is way too many. I'm already starting to get dizzy. This entire challenge, I've been getting water out of this sink. And I'm going to be honest, this, uh, this in, it, you can't even speak. I'm not, you can't well, even speak. Circle properly. is a flavor cartridge you can screw on your water bottle. It makes bland water taste amazing. There's over a hundred different flavors that fit this bottle oh, wow. that are all zero calories and zero sugar. <sighs> Moving this tripod is miserable. <clears throat> Choose how intense you want the flavor <laughs> and wow. then start drinking away. It honestly adds so much flavor, I can't even tell it's sink water. I've been drinking fruit punch throughout this entire challenge, and it actually makes the water taste amazing. Um, I'm gonna walk back and forth between these walls. These cartridges also last for multiple refills of your water bottle, which is good because the boys suck at sending these, and sometimes I gotta use the same one for a whole day. If you wanna start drinking more water, or just want your water to start tasting good in general, yeah. go to drinkcircle.com or your local Walmart water. to give it a try. I've tried everything you know, I'm trying. to keep myself entertained, and I'm gonna be honest. This is, this is literally my water. And after I finished all my circles, Carl drinking. brought back two people from 100 Days Trapped Together. We're here. Hey, check oh. it out. You guys are going to love this. That's the face of the guy that trapped you guys for 100 days. <laughs> <laughs> Would you say this is easier or harder than what you guys did? In comparison, I think I'd rather have, like someone else in it with me and now that the tables had turned and i was the one inside the white cube bailey and Susie got their revenge so i'll show you guys how the conveyor belt works oh no they're gonna get revenge on him they're gonna send him an empty tray <laughs> they sent an empty tray he's about to freak out oh my god this is what he gets i bet every dollar in my bank account carl just showed up no. Simulation he's had in days. Holy shit. Well, you gotta give him credit. I probably deserve that. 48 more hours? Imagine this is what happens after you die. You just go to a white room like this forever. Dude. That would be miserable. I was about to say, it would be very miserable. When I sleep, I dream of me in the outside world. And when I'm awake, I'm just depressed, lonely, and to be honest, miserable. So the more time I spend sleeping, <laughs> the happier I am. Let me out. I'm Batman. I'm Batman. He's getting very, very I close. Dead. I really need to get out of here. We did seven days on a raft. Did seven days buried alive, and now seven days in solitary confinement. If I had known how hard this would be, I never would have done this. If that hour number in the top left says anything higher than 20, oh. I'm gonna lose my mind. Yeah. I am feeling extremely lonely. I, I miss my girlfriend. This is torture. Yeah. Is he crying? He's not doing well. He's just like napping on the floor, throwing things, having tantrums, getting happy when he gets snacks. He's like a child. I think there's oh, is that his girlfriend? Left, and then they're gonna open that door right there, and I am free. I am free. Please be eight hours. He thinks he's sleeping through the last couple hours right now. That's what he thinks this is. So it's gonna be a rude awakening, yeah. literally. To be honest, it's concerning. Oh my god, one more day. I give it maybe another two to three one. hours and that door opens. Don't nope. my last meal. Maybe enough you know, maybe times that. Did he just say it's his last meal? I think so. Well that's ironic because it's literally exactly twenty four hours. Any hour now, they're gonna be walking through that door. So I'm gonna clean up the place. It's a little messy, you know. I was trying to make up an excuse to clean, but in reality, I'm just bored. I thought coming into this experiment, I would get more mental clarity, maybe learn a little bit about myself. But in reality, all I'm walking away with is the newfound skill of being able to throw things out a conveyor belt door. <laughs> or maybe not. There is just no world where there's more than 24 hours left. I can't do another 24 hours in here. I'm at my limit, but it doesn't even matter. There's just not 24 hours He's left. He's getting so just, close. I, so I close yet so far. That. So any second now. Any second. No. Any second. No. To pass the time, Me. I'm gonna resume counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There's nobody eight, in there. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Oh my god, that flower. 15, 16, That's a success. 18, 18, ten hours left. Nine. 
Oh. He's actually. I swear to God, I heard something out there. Oh. Hmm. Three hours left, dude. Three hours I'm left. I'm sad. I'm sad. Two I hours. Sad. Oh my God! Now I there's two hours left. Holy sad. shit! I can't wait to see how he is when the time is up and he's finally free. I'm here. He's trying to sleep through it. This is barely human. He's lying in bed, covering his eyes, no excitement. This is totally not what you want to say. How is he going to act? Is he going to be a new human? I'm worried he's going to be this human. He's just collapsed into dysfunction. We've never pushed him as far as he has pushed in this video. Well, because he's been totally deprived of any human contact. Be gentle. Like a little kid waking up from a nap. Well, there's 10 minutes left, so let's go get ready. Thank you. Good luck. Oh, uh, four minutes. He's just, he's just awesome. finally happy he's the out. I've seen you <laughs> Honestly, I thought it was perpetually just going to be 24 hours forever. Follow me outside. I want to see the sun. He's finally going to see the sun. Oh, my God. It's dark, oh, it's dark outside. Dark. So nice to see the outside world. Yeah. And a big ass <laughs> fireworker missile that was right there. Oh, motherfucker. I just hit my keyboard. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Holy shit, dude. That's just, that's just insane. That's literally just insane, dude. He was losing his mind. He was going crazy. He was getting paranoid. He had insomnia. So much fucking problems was happening. Oh my God. The, the moment he finally was able to just get out of that damn room. He was the happiest he's ever been in a while. So, uh, we didn't even get to see him with his girlfriend. Like, the first time he saw his girlfriend in over seven days. That would have been a very heartwarming ending to this. But Mr. Beast made it through the whole challenge. I'm very surprised. I honestly thought he was going to somehow quit through this. But I guess, I guess his friends just pushed him through anyway. They weren't, they like, the, even the doctor that was there, he just... Just explain the problems that Mr. Beast more likely is having. And he made it through. He seriously made it through the whole damn challenge. I more than likely wouldn't be able to survive a day in there. I will probably kill myself. So, <sighs> yeah. Anyways, guys, um, if you do enjoy this, be sure to give this video a like. If you haven't yet subscribed, be sure to do so right now. And turn on notifications to be notified for any video that I upload. And I'll catch you guys later in the next one whenever I start doing that. So, Hope you guys enjoy. I'll catch you guys later. So take care.